Hey guys, this is uh, Funny Guy Timmy. Um, after uh, editing and and uh, and finishing the second half of uh, split screening, the editing portion, uh, I realized that um, the screen recorder um, didn't work well with Magix. So uh, the real time rendering on Magix didn't show up, uh, you know, uh, what you'd be actually looking at on the film. Um, so it just has these blank spots. Um, so I kind of feel bad about that. But, uh, but, you know, you can still follow along, you can still understand what it is that I'm doing, and, uh, you know, and, and find out how to do split screen on, on programs like Magic's. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and post it. Just I uh, wanted to give you all a heads up that, that there's no, you can't see um, where on the video I'm doing all this. So, uh, sorry. But uh, here it is. Alrighty. Hello everyone. This is Funny Guy Timmy uh, with part two of split screening. Um, the editing portion. Uh, today I'm going to be using Magic's Video Editor Pro 12. Uh, uh, as you can see, I have started a new project and I have uh, imported the uh, the raw footage from the first uh, video of split screening uh, into the timeline. Uh, as you can see, uh, like stated before, it is all in one take. Um, so, uh, the first thing uh, that I will do uh, is cut the footage uh, in half. Now, uh, I would like to state that, that the split screening doesn't have to be done on Magics. Um, it can really be done on pretty much any uh, video editing program. Um, it, the program just needs to have uh, multiple um, timelines to put stuff in and um, uh, picture size and positioning um, uh, tool. Alrighty, so I'm going to zip ahead to, let's say, right about here and cut the video in half. Now I'm going to uh, tweak it later. I'm going to change the length uh, later. So now we have uh, one video over the other. Uh, however, uh, I actually have to move this one down because uh, down here is actually um, uh, what would be over the other. Alrighty. So now we have the two um, halves, uh, one over the other. And now all I'm going to do is go to the the one the the half that is over uh, the other one and go into video uh, picture size and positioning click that already uh, don't show all objects uh, crop size and don't keep proportions all right I'm just gonna skip ahead to right about here so I can see that uh, vertical line that I was talking about uh, in the the uh, first video. So now I'm just going to drag and pull until we get right about on top of that, right there. Alrighty. Now I can click this to see what it looks like underneath. Very nice. Kind of move back and forth with this. So it looks good so far. Click OK. Alrighty. Now I'm going to go ahead and um, move this in and decrease uh, the length of the opening of that. Oh! If you look at the uh, the the funny guy Timmy reaching 
into the abyss or the nether nether regions. Uh, so now we have to crop that down to where you can't see them doing that. Nice. Nice pot to cut it right there. Do the same thing. Cut it down. And there you go. That is split screening. The absolute uh, most basic uh, effect uh, there is. Uh, now, like I said, you can do this with pretty much uh, any video editing program. Uh, Mag I used Magix because that's that's the one I use. Uh, there's no other reason than that. Uh, so uh, anyway, I hope that was uh, helpful and uh, look forward to uh, hearing uh, feedback on this. All right, see you later.